Hardware and software in this video were provided as part of the MetaQuest Creator Program. Hey folks, welcome to another VR video. Today we're checking out Homeworld Vast Reaches on the Quest 3. Now, Homeworld is a series that's been around for years on PC, and it's not one I expected actually to come to virtual reality. We're going to play on easy and begin our campaign. And we're going to skip the cutscenes. Alright, so we've got an unexplored Can't. asteroid there. Online. We've it's got our mothership here. Them. Being fused with the mothership takes getting used to. Remember your training. Flow with the ship. Don't grasp at the data. You're coming in clear, Karen. But I can hear everything. At the same time, it's amazing. Fleet intelligence will take you through some exercises now, Commander. But I'm here, and you can call on me as well. Fleet intelligence officer online. My task is to collate information, analyze sensor data, and provide objectives. First, I will guide you through systems tests. Open the sensors manager now. So the sensors manager is here. The okay, sensors that's manager cool. Shows you a map of your local environment. That's cool. Including the heart of command operations, the mothership. Current mission objectives are also displayed prominently in your right, sensors. So that must be that blue thing. Understood. Complete each exercise. Commander, let go. Right now, self is your enemy. Our next test is of your navigation systems to help you gain tactical awareness around the mothership. First, we will try moving around your environment. There we go. That's easy. You can move your view of the world using several methods. That works too, but I actually prefer the thumbstick. You can also zoom your view in and out. Okay. Yeah, that's... That's the way I actually prefer to move. And then rotation. And I don't really like the rotation. I'll use the grips to rotate. You can teleport your viewpoint and instantly move it anywhere within range. Okay. So we can teleport right there. Okay, that's cool. This is stunning. I have spent years staring at the tactical screens, but never like this. Remember when you merge with the sensor data, you can see everything, everywhere. You can make so many decisions so quickly, but you are not infinite. Never forget that. We will now focus on your fleet of ships and how to command them. Oh, good, Let's a fleet of ships. Start by surveying the ships you have available. They are placed into functional formations called strike groups. Ooh, there's a lot of them, so... Let's uh, press the selector striker. You can give strike groups movement orders. Move the strike group over here. Heading confirmed. That's cool. So all of our ships right now are moving toward this asteroid. It's cool. Look at those little ships. So this being an RTS, uh, I'm assuming we're going to have a lot of those. Mobilization underway. Oops. Hmm. <clears throat> I'll hold and drag to the destination. Okay, so let's go right there. Coordinates confirmed. That's cool. So different movement mechanics and different ways to get there. You can also give strike groups attack orders. Strike group alpha responding. Strike group alpha attack order. Control. All right, here we go. This is the part that I like. The action. Facing simulated enemies, which will not fight back. Of course, real enemies will. That's it, Commander. You're getting cool. it. Cool. So direct. So immediate. 
You are experiencing all the things only I have known. <laughs> you and I now make a very exclusive pair. Uh, so we're going to deselect our strike groups. Open the command palette. Is this the command palette? Oh, this is the command palette, okay. Pull to interact with the command palette, okay. Uh. Hmm. Pull to interact with the command palette. Okay, so interact once to select a strike group twice. Strike group alpha, okay. ready for orders. Strike group alpha, reporting. Tactical pause allows you to stop the okay. action so that you can plan your next moves. There we go. Including spending resources to build new ships. So we're going to build a strike group. Interceptor transferred to strike group alpha. All right. And then, oh, we could just drag these all in, it looks like. Interceptor transferred to strike group alpha. I'll drag these ones into the strike group. Interceptor inbound. Interceptor filling out the formation of Strike Group Alpha. Now they want us to transfer a ship here, so we'll do that. Interceptor deployed as part of Strike Group Bravo. Interceptor added to Strike Group Bravo. Okay, I see. Interceptor reinforcing Strike Group Bravo. So we've got our ships all. Moved here. Interceptor inbound. Coordinates confirmed. Tactical pause. So we're going to take one ship, group, move it to the other one. Interceptor, accepting new assignment. You can also retire ships in your strike groups that you no longer need and get some resources returned to your reserves. Okay. Grab a ship out of the strike group. Okay. The cool. ships are all yours now. Be careful with them, like they are a part of you. I have always felt that way. The ships are part of me? This, you will hear every loss now. Be prepared for that. You also have the ability to give commands to more than one strike. I'm assuming I just time. select both, right? Yeah. Moving into position. Strike group Bravo responding. Strike group Alpha in position. You can also set up more advanced movement patterns for your strike groups using waypoints. So final waypoint is here. So we're gonna move here first. On our way. And then here second. Destination confirmed. I want to move here first. Coordinates confirmed. Hold down this one. And then there. All right. I should do that. Perfect. Use waypoints to navigate to attack those enemy ships while avoiding the gun platform. Okay, so we need to avoid the gun platform.
There we go. So we're moving around this gun platform so it doesn't hit us. And we're going to zoom in. Destination confirmed. Oops. Confirmed. Heading to destination. Locked on target. There we go. So we've avoided this gun target. Gun platform, rather. And we're going to watch this battle as close as we can get with it being fairly comfortable here. Because we've got a lot of ships coming in. This should be pretty cool. Nice. Look at those explosions. This concludes our task of core systems. Well done, nice. Commander. But now it's time to push your limits. I'm sending you the coordinates for the Rada meeting point. For this, okay. you are on your own. Hyperspace manipulation is for a singular mind. You can do this. It feels just like a simulation. I will not lie. Hyperspatial math is not my strongest suit. Just keep control of the equations as you feed them to the hyperspace core and then open the door. Roger that. Hyperspace, engage on my mark. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, mark. Our ship is going into hyperspace. That's pretty cool. That's actually a pretty cool effect in VR. Space jump. Successful. I knew you could do it. We are early for our rendezvous with the Rada. Let's not put the time to waste. Scanning for resources in our vicinity. Acknowledged. Command, this sector is rife with asteroids and rich dust clouds. One of your strike groups contains resource collectors which can be used for harvesting. Initiate at will. Any objections, Commander Karen Sajet? Former Commander. Your ship, your orders, Commander Tira Soban. Strike Group Charlie, en route. Deploying. Strike there we go, so we're resource collecting now. Necessary resources secure. Continuing to gather resources is important for Mothership Systems' health and keeps our construction bays capable of building more ships. We now have the resources to build a scout unit, so we can pinpoint the location of the rock. So this will give us a scout unit. So it wants us to build a scout unit. That's over here. Use this to build the scout unit. So we're going to utility. Nope. Fighter, interceptor, there's scout. Scout. Signed at Strike Group nice. Alpha. Okay. And then we built the scout unit. We can unpause. Now, what do I need to do with the scout unit? Field identified and locked in. Okay, they're building the scout right now. Scout joining formation. What's that? Greetings, Higar Okay, Command. good. This is Rada Admiral Geit. Hopefully there are Commander side. Alma relays her wishes for a long and fruitful partnership with the Hagaran people. Sweet. And now that pleasantries are out of the way, let us begin. I live for a great battle. As do I. Rada craft signatures detected in this sector. I thought it best for our skirmish to involve live fire. I found it's the only way to truly learn. What? Are we agreed? Good. I don't really want a live Game battle. Precise coordinates on the Rada craft. Have your scout perform reconnaissance with a sensor sweep. Strike group Alpha, waiting assignment. Try using a sensor sweep here, okay? Initiating sensor sweep run. Our scouts are coming in here, and they're coming in hot. The first Rada skirmish group has been detected. This is it, Fleet Command. Take them on with one of your combat strike groups. Okay, so they're over there. Reports enemy forces. 
Headed back to strike group. Strike group Bravo in position. Advancing to position. Coordinates confirmed. Strike group Bravo en route. Advancing to position. All right, here we go. Strike group Bravo is going down to take on the Rotter ships. I like being able to position the camera in any manner that I want. This is really cool. Strike group Bravo taking incoming rounds. All right. Now there's a couple more back here. Strike group Bravo, nice. take Second rod out patrol signature detected. All right, so they're coming you in. see their position in the sensors manager. I see it all. Moving into position. Confirmed. Heading to destination. Destination confirmed. Strike group Bravo acknowledged. On our way. Target acquired. Strike group Alpha standing by. Confirmed. Heading to destination. All right, here we go. Both of our strike groups are going in. We've got way more ships than they do, so I think we're going to be okay. A couple more. Round in the bend. Strike group Alpha taking incoming rounds. Okay. Third round. Intelligence reports say the Rada utilize very high level technology, but I haven't seen anything uh -huh. remarkable yet. Where are they? Where's our scout ship? That's not the scout, that's the depleted asteroid. So let's take this. So this asteroid over here. Oh, contains no units. Hold on. Strike group Charlie on mission. Right, so we should be able to ma mine that. Resource field identified and locked in. Uh, we need to find our scout. Out. Strike group alpha reporting. Scan. And then let's go over here. Launching for sensor sweep. Because I'm not sure where the final tactical battle is going to take place. Collection order confirmed. Scan of area complete. Okay. That didn't come up with anything. Resource field identified and locked in. What's that over there, actually? Is that a ship? No. Okay. Local scans find no more right. resources. So, going back to our scout. Do a tactical pause. I'm going to reinforce A and B here. We had some attack bombers. Attack bomber filling out the formation of Strike Group Alpha. All right, so we've, we've added some new characters. To A and B. We're waiting for those to be built. And then we need to figure out where the third Rada patrol is. I'm trying to find a third Rada patrol. Mm -hmm. 
Scouts available for reconnaissance. Attack bomber reporting to strike. So we've got two sets of scouts. No, I need I need to figure out Strike Group Alpha awaiting orders. Scout. Let's do this. Initiating and then hopefully we will find the enemy that we're looking for. Sensor sweep complete. Still haven't found our enemy. Can't do another strike yet. We've got enough RUs now to There they come. Strike group Bravo responding. Strike group Bravo on mission. Moving into position. Target confirmed. Strike group Bravo reporting. Here we go. Strike group Bravo reporting. Of course it's enemy fire. We did it. Commander of the Rada fleet. I am declaring Tidani Agreement TR3 in effect. What? What agreement? In return for a considerable investment from us, the Tidani Emperor agreed to share all technology related to a hyperspace core. We made no such agreement. When the Tidon Empire fell, you inherited the planet Hagara and all legal agreements pertaining to it. You are bound by that agreement to relinquish your hyperspace core or face default. Thank you for your cooperation. Rada frigates have jumped in near the mothership. Scanning Rada frigates. They are a beta class threat. They could do us great harm. They are not joking. Your governing body has not complied in the given time period and is in default. Though we anticipated this result, we wish to assure you we are only taking what is legally ours. Time to cooperate and stand down. I've got your cooperation right here. Fleet to battle positions. Target acquired. Strike group Bravo waiting for command. The Radar missile frigates are capable of breaching the hull of the mothership. Damage to the mothership from the hull breach is substantial. Our situation is urgent. Interceptor signed at Strike Group Charlie. Right, so I'm going to take Strike Group Charlie in too, because we have three sets. Heading confirmed. Strike Group Charlie. All right, here we go. We've got three frigates. They're attacking our mothership. Our ships were way off in the distance. I'm hoping we can save the mothership by the time. Strike group Charlie welcoming new interceptor. All right, these frigates are actually going down. Strike group Bravo at the ready. Strike group Bravo en route. Attack limits received. Radar frigates neutralized, but the mothership has sustained significant damage. Additional radar units incoming. Tira, there's too many. I know the mothership won't take much more of this. Let's get out. Jump us out of here. That is my decision, Look at all of them. We need an isolated location to recruit. Jumping the mothership and fleet now. Here we go. 
The Rada have attacked us. They've betrayed us. And we're out. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'll look at the recently released RTS real-time strategy game, Homeworld Vast Reaches. I have to give a shout out. Back in the Nintendo DS days, they always did a play on words with the letters D and S. Uh, I like the fact that Homeworld has taken VR and made vast reaches. I will be back with more content soon. Until next time, get out there and enjoy some VR for yourself. And thanks for watching. Bye-bye now.